Electrical failures all over Tower 6. The light is flowing like liquid. Its sense of purpose is overwhelming. There's something in... Steven? Steven, is that you? Meg? Meg, are you here? Here. I'm in the lounge. There are too many empty houses tonight. Most of the village has gone now. My head's killing me. Have you listened to the phones? No, I thought they were all dead. There's a strange kind of static now. I think I heard numbers in it. It sounded like the American woman. Kate? She's still alive. No one's seen her. I is Charlie back? Not yet, no. I'm sorry. That's all right, Father. Listen, you go on ahead. I'll just rest here a little longer. Sleep well.
I've been recording the pattern for three hours and so far have accumulated over three megabytes of binary data. The pattern does not, at this point, seem to be part of any recognizably closed loop, but there remains symmetry, despite the conflicts. If you could just have a word with them, perhaps, that they listen to you. Well, I really don't see what it has to do with me at all. The village looks up to you. I just think that what's been happening with Mr. Coles and Mrs. Boughton and the others, that people need somewhere to talk, to feel safe. Perhaps they don't think that your church is somewhere they feel particularly safe. I don't need your forgiveness, Wendy. Or theirs. Whosoever thou art that judgest, for wherein thou judgest another, thou condemnest thyself. Romans chapter 2, verse 1. Beware of practicing your righteousness before other people in order to be seen by them. Matthew chapter 6, verse 1. It's not my judgment you should be worried about, Father. But fine. I'll talk to Barbara. Ask her to put a note up in the surgery about an extra service. Will that do?
It wasn't just some distortion of physics. They may not understand it yet, but it wasn't an accident. All of the clocks, what happened at Tower 6, it's just not random. There's an effort. An attempt to communicate. Meg, come and have a look at this. Oh, I don't believe it. Charlie! Jeremy reckons someone had been raiding all the empty houses. He said a load of stuff had been taken. What's up? It looks like someone's been collecting their own supplies. Bastard! Well, we've got enough stock in the warehouse to keep the entire village going for months. We should get a truck. What, and go and get all of it now? Yeah, why not? It's Appleton. It's that bloody crackpot Stephen Appleton. I'm gonna fucking do him. Sam, it's fine. We'd better get moving before the weather turns. You come in. We'll swing by the camp and get Rachel on the way back. <laughs> 